We begin tonight with a story that's a little humorous, but unmistakably rude. It's not a proper way to say hello to you all this evening, but it is our top story. Thanks for joining us. I'm Jessica Janner. Take a look at a problem plaguing downtown Amarillo, and yes, we have blurred out anything that could be offensive. It's first on Fox. It's a mystery circuit problem that's been infecting downtown streetlights, and it's caused birds to nest in the pedestrian crosswalk sign. And we don't mean the ones usually found in trees or in the wild. We mean the wildly offensive birds usually found in road rage. Yeah, it's flipping people off. <laughs> what do you think about that? I don't like it. I just not noticed it, and I go across here every day. Tell me if you see something wrong with it. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I do. What do you think? I think they need to fix that right away. The city of Amarillo says it's a manufacturing problem that causes a glitch and produces offensive hand gestures. They've had reports since November, complaints from residents reading between the lines. They need to change it. <laughs> well, they've got to fix that. That's just down date route. Don't worry, they have. In fact, the city was out here just minutes after we called today. And the finger flipping off the old courthouse is now giving a high five. They wouldn't go on camera with us, but the city says they're fixing the crosswalk signs as reports come in. Since, after all, you wouldn't want a tourist from Scotland to think Amarillo's unfriendly. Appalling sight of do a they bird. do that in Scotland? We don't give anybody any rude things in Scotland. No, mm. Scotland, they're all polite people and they never do anything. We, in fact, I've never seen that sign before and if you hadn't explained it to me, I wouldn't have a clue what it was all about. The middle finger is not the only offensive hand gesture we found, uh, but it's so offensive we can't say any more about it here on the evening news. All signs right now 